My brothers and sisters, President Hinckley has requested that I now present to you the General Authorities, Area Authority 70s, and General Auxiliary Presidencies of the Church for your sustaining vote. It is proposed that we sustain Gordon Bittner Hinckley as prophet, seer, and revelator, and president of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. Thomas Spencer Monson as first counselor in the First Presidency, and James Ezra Faust as second counselor in the First Presidency. Those in favor may manifest it. Those opposed, if any, may manifest it. It is proposed that we sustain Thomas Spencer Monson as president of the Quorum of the Twelve Apostles, Boyd Kenneth Packer as acting president of the Quorum of the Twelve Apostles, and the following members of that quorum, Boyd K. Packer, L. Tom Perry, David B. Haight, Neil A. Maxwell, Russell M. Nelson, Alan H. Oakes, M. Russell Ballard, Joseph B. Worthlin, Richard G. Scott, Robert D. Hales, Jeffrey R. Holland, and Henry B. Eyring. Those in favor, please manifest it. Any opposed? It is proposed that we sustain the counselors in the First Presidency and Twelve Apostles as prophet, seers, and revelators. All in favor, please manifest it. Contrary, if there be any, by the same sign. It is proposed that we extend an official vote of appreciation to Elders J. Richard Clark, Dean L. Larson, and Robert E. Wells, that they be designated as emeritus members of the First Quorum of the Seventy, and that Elder Larson be released as church historian and recorder. Those who wish to join in an expression of appreciation for their service, please manifest it. With gratitude for their service as members of the Second Quorum of the Seventy, we extend an honorable release to Elders Lino Alvarez, C. Max Caldwell, John E. Fowler, Augusto A. Lim, V. Dallas Merrill, F. David Stanley, and Kwok Win Tai. Those who wish to join in an expression of appreciation, please indicate by the uplifted hand. It is proposed that we sustain Elders John A. Grincieri and David W. Eka as Area Authority 70s. Those in favor manifest it. Those opposed may also manifest it. Since the April General Conference, Elder F. David Sanley was called to succeed Elder Von J. Featherstone as First Counselor in the Young Men General Presidency. It is proposed that we release with a vote of thanks Elder F. Burton Howard as First Counselor and Elder Glenn L. Pace as Second Counselor in the Sunday School General Presidency and Elder F. David Stanley as First Counselor and Elder Robert K. Dellenbaugh as Second Counselor in the Young Men General Presidency. Those who wish to join in an expression of appreciation to all of these brethren, please manifest it. It is proposed that we sustain Elder Glenn L. Pace as first counselor in the Sunday School General Presidency and Elder Neil L. Anderson as second counselor in the Sunday School General Presidency. Elder Robert K. Dellenbaugh as First Counselor in the Young Men General Presidency, and Elder F. Melvin Hammond as Second Counselor in the Young Men General Presidency. Those in favor, please manifest it. Any opposed? It is proposed that we release with a vote of thanks and sincere appreciation Sisters Jeanette Hales Beckham Virginia H. Pierce, 
and Carol B. Thomas as the Young Women General Presidency. We also release all members of the Young Women General Board. All who wish to join in an expression of gratitude for the excellent service of these wonderful sisters may do so. It is proposed that we sustain Sisters Margaret Diring Nadald, Carol Burnett Thomas, and Sharon Green Larson as the Young Women General Presidency. Those in favor, please manifest it. Any opposed by the same sign. It is proposed that we sustain the other general authorities, Area Authority 70s and General Auxiliary Presidencies as at presently constituted. Those in favor, please manifest it. Any opposed may manifest it. It appears that the sustaining has been unanimous in the affirmative. Thank you, brothers and sisters, for your faith and prayers. We shall now ask the new general, young women general presidency to take their places on the stand. <clears throat> 